Hey everyone, how's it going? What is up? It is me, Windstalker. And today, I was challenged to a challenge in which I accepted, which I'm starting to think that maybe I shouldn't have because this could technically maybe be nasty. But anyway, I was challenged to drink this, the Pepsi 1893 Original Cola. There's a ginger version, but... I don't particularly like ginger, so there's no way in you know where that I'm going to try it. So let's see, it's 12 fluid ounces, which is actually kind of surprising, because that's a standard Pepsi, believe it or not. 150 calories per can, interesting, low sodium, and uh, let's see, boldly blended cola made with cola nut extract dark brown malt flavor a touch of aromic bitter sparkling water and real sugar um yeah maybe i should have went with the uh, mountain dew black first which i think is going to be equally nasty but anyway here we go okay i know i'm supposed to have video this and send the video to be watched by everybody but i'm going to do this on camera so here we go there's the top being popped okay here's my glass with ice in it we're going to pour it up let her breathe because i think this is going to be absolutely nasty but the good news is, is if this is nasty, I never have to buy it again. And this challenge is finished. Okay. So, there's the empty can. And there's the glass. Doesn't smell too bad. It smells like... Doesn't smell too bad. Could be nasty, of course. I won't. Um, I really don't want to do this. This might be gross. This is smell bad. There we go. No Pepsis in a few hours, so there's nothing to cloud my taste buds. And all I have to do is drink this, no matter how gross it is. So, here we go. Ah, oh, that is gross. Yeah. What am I tasting? It's either going to be the cola nut extract, the dark brown malt flavor, or the aromic bitter. Ew. Yeah, that's a good thing that I'm never going to have to taste this again because. I definitely couldn't drink this all the time. This is just highly gross. And the fact that I'm doing this for the first time is bad enough. Oh, boy. It's cool looking can, though. still I gotta get through this I'm expecting the Mountain Dew black to be as bad as if not worse I can't believe I'm doing this this is oh God 
it's not so much the actual taste. It's like, actually, after you drink a little bit of it, it gets better, if that's possible. It's not so much the actual taste taste. It's like the aftertaste. Yeah, it's definitely the aftertaste. This is gross. Oh, so gross. Good news is... I guess it gets better. I know I said that it got better. And it does get better. I mean, you still can taste that. Whatever that is. I have no idea what it is. But I still can't drink it all the time. Yeah, this isn't my cup of tea. I'll stick with regular Pepsi, thank you. I can't believe it. I still don't have that much left. It's like... Yeah. Why did I agree to do this challenge again? All right. Okay. Yuck. Now, taking big gulps of this really doesn't help. <sighs> Dang. Okay. Okay, done. Okay, so maybe it wasn't as bad as I made it out to be. I mean, the first few sips was actually the worst because you could really uh, taste whatever that was. So it made it a little bit more, um, yeah, made it a little bit more whatever. But after, you know, you it's kind of like Zima. If anybody have ever drink, drunk Zima, the beer, where you drink like half of it and it tastes awful. And then by the time you drink the other three, because I think it only comes on a six pack, your taste buds just doesn't care no more. That's how that was. It, um... They suppose don't care. It's like, uh, yeah, it's a, a bold spin on an original cola. Yeah, it's definitely something on a spin on an original cola. Fair trade certified sugar. What does that even mean anyway? 
Okay, sugar, caramel, phosphoric acid, sodium. Yeah, um, thirty-four milligrams of sugar or caffeine. I mean, Fair Trade certified by Fair Trade USA, excluding water. More than eighty percent Fair Trade certified ingredients. Mm, Eighteen ninety-three is trademarked by Pepsi, huh? Yeah, well, Pepsi, I'm not drinking this no more. This is the one shot only kill on this one. And um, you guys can have yourself a good day. That's, that that was just not my cup of tea. Not that great. And... um. <laughs> Thank you, but I'm done. Because, yeah. Because, I mean, even if you get past the first bit and, you know, your taste buds kind of die off and are like, meh, whatever. It's just no regular Pepsi. And I still have to go with... This... Mountain Dew Black Label. And this is 16 ounces. It's like, holy cow. Dew crafted with dark berry. That just sounds really nasty. I don't know. But at any rate, next up. But if you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below. Subscribe. And I'll see you guys on the flip side.